Welcome back to Gaming Assembled. Today is part 8 of our Madeira campaign. Thank you for joining us. Before we start, we'd love to hear from you. So like, comment and subscribe to the channel and interact with us on social media. And thank you to Nash Willis for commenting already. Let's get started. Okay, so let's get stuck back in. Um, so, in today's episode, we are going to look and trying to get our kingdom. Uh, our fella is getting a bit old now, so really we need to try and get on with it. Uh, we are 60, uh, Emir Massenson, the Impaler. Um, so he's not the, the young man he once was. And obviously on succession, things are going to go a little bit screwy and we're going to lose a lot of land. So it would be better if our heir could inherit a kingdom, because then she will be queen of the entire thing still so that will hopefully help to uh, so we don't lose quite as much progress so what we need to do we need to try and claim our leisure's title so and we we can do that but we need 800 prestige so our first mission of today's session is to try and get our prestige up so we are nearly at a point where we can do another hunt we are a couple of years away from being able to host another feast. So let's get cracking. Let's set this thing going. We'll nearly be there for, let's say, the hunt. We need a little gold, six gold, not too much. Uh, September 901. So let's have a look. So any events that come up, what we're trying to do is trying to screw a bit of prestige out of it. It is going up, obviously, on its own as well. But any more that we can get is uh, a bonus. So, uh, Haston, I didn't know he was still alive. Jesus, he's 85. Wow. Um, <laughs> he's been going a while. Um, so, he's been writing poetry. That must be the secret to uh, longevity. Um, now, well, Haston's been our friend through quite a bit now, for quite a long time. Um... And although we are not massively disposed at poetry, we are gregarious. So we're quite friendly. So I think that it's truly heartfelt, and I think that's what we do. Um, because, wow, as I say, I didn't know he was still alive. 85, wow. People don't live that long generally in the game. Oh, hang on, we can ransom some people. Bit of gold. No, he's not going up for that yet. Can demand some payments. Outliving a child. All right, so her lands have gone to my granddaughter. So what happened to her? Flagellant, murderer, wounded. Wow, okay, so she was on a, a rough old time. Uh, demand payments. So we can demand 50 gold from her. Brilliant, let's bring that on. And he's not got enough, as we've said. 21 out of 50, we'll wait a little bit longer there. Hopefully we'll not die before that happens. Um, we'll get an alliance with our daughters. Keep some out of factions and things. Ask for a pardon. I don't really care. Um, he can try and imprison us if he wants. He's, he's not going to succeed. <laughs> um, he's, only, he's not got many men between him uh, he's what what 700 odd men and he's got ooh that's interesting he's got him as an ally that is interesting I wonder if it comes down to claim Lee's title whether he'll end up calling him in that would be a massive problem for us let's see if we can <laughs> I doubt we will but how could this happen? My agents were waiting and waiting. Correct time, place, never appeared. So, um, I think we scheme. It's it's not going to succeed. We tried to kill him last time, if you remember, and uh, uh, it didn't quite happen. Um, I don't care if she's you know, at this point. She's sixty-four. I'm. My fella's, our fella's 61, 
Who who really cares? There's no she's not she's a secondary spouse. Um fine, we'll just give her the benefit of the doubt. She can cheat all she wants, there's no babies involved, it's fine. Uh right, we should be able to do when can we do a hunt? Oh, a few months. Can try and get a little bit more prestige and we'll pretty much be there then, I think. Not be far off. Call to war. Why not? Death to us part, another Another wife gone. Oh, she's our primary one now. We're, we're ticking through them. Okay. Right. Okay, I didn't realise he did that. After the primary one goes, the secondary one gets promoted. I, I didn't realise that happened. Okay, that's good. Uh, right, where's this war? We might as well have a look at it while we're, while we're doing. Uh, go on then, let's raise our army. We'll send some troops down to... Uh, to fight, um, let's land them. Where can we land them? Land them there. Oh, we're walking, are we? Oh well, we're not in a. It's fine. Oh, we're fighting. Who are we fighting? Where are we? Oh, okay. They must have been coming up. up, up. Oh, it's some raiders. <laughs> well, that was lucky. We stopped the raiders as they got into us. Right, petition leads. No, I don't want to do that. So I'll use prestige. No, oh, disband. Before we even got there. Are they still attacking us? No, they're not. They've wandered off. That's fine. Education at an end. Who's this? Our, our grandson. Okay, fair enough. No problems. Crack on. Carry on down there. Use our point. So we should now. Um, it's May 902. Let's get some more of these fellas. There we go. Bring in some more champions. Uh, right. So we should now be able to do our hunt. Yes, we can. So let's see if we can get a little bit more prestige. The White Wolf. I'm riding ahead of the group as the hills suddenly grow still around me. The silence is almost palpable. And I struggle to hear even the noise of the horse's hooves. Just as I'm about to turn back to find the others, I glimpse it ahead of me. Blurry as in a dream. A wolf as white as snow. Uh, right, so like something from a tale, I must have it. Or it's just a wolf, I will hunt others. So what does that one give us just for a start? Stewardship and prowess. Hmm. Okay, focused attention. Uh, there might be some prestige in it for that. Why not? I follow the white wolf into the hills. An almost unnatural silence hangs heavy over us and the sudden sound of a voice startles me. My lord, there you are. I turn around and see the rest of my party having caught up to me. As I look back, the wolf is gone. It must have gotten away this time. And I scouted ahead, yes. Okay, so... Right. So... Nothing or some opinion. We'll go with opinion. And 150 prestige, prestige. So that's some... 22nd of August. Okay. So 22nd of August, we can do a... Feast, I think. Was it this year or was it next year? Next year. August 903. After five years, the funds I set aside for the uh, patronage of my court poet uh, has run out. I can now choose whether or not to renew my patronage for another five years to let her go, or to let her go. Uh, extend my patronage gives me piety and, cl and clergy opinion. She has been doing good work. Give her a bonus. So, get some opinion as well, or no longer required. Well, I've got the gold, why not? I'll do that, gets a little bit of piety. Uh, right, a story about the fire roars, drinks have been had, and Tahona and I, uh, sorry, and Tahona is calling out to, uh, for, to me for a story. 
My first thought is of a famous uh, folk tale, a classic that never fails to delight. On the other hand, what if I told a story of my own life, perhaps of the time my daughter was born? So, uh, I can form friendship, get closer to forming friendship with my wife. I can tell my own story and get a little prestige, or I can do both and get even more. We'll do both. May get even more prestige. Excellent. Um, roadside stall. While travelling across the drylands of the sheikdom of Taza, I find a makeshift looking stall by the side of the track. As I stop and take a look, a peasant by the name of Mifia, Mifiaya, Mifaya, jumps into action, trying to convince me to buy one of the small uh, Gortimak carving she has on sale uh, I make them by hand my lord each one takes me hours of work um, so I can get a small artifact uh, sure let's have an artifact again we've got the money why not eh? supported local business brilliant can always help outlived another child so, wounded and disfigured. This is my son, I guess. So, my grandson has taken, well, two grandsons have taken his titles. So, what I need is just to get round to September. Um, thank you for bringing this to my attention. Yet it belongs in my dungeon. Well, I think that's probably more what we would do. Nearly there. July. August. Feast. Let's get some more prestige. Feast begins. Uh, pleading gaze I receive my son-in-law uh, is taking on a desperate tour and a group of guests are approaching the corner he has hid in all evening and the walls are hindering his escape. The poor man has never been good with people. I will distract the converging guests, and I get a weak hook on him. Uh, I'll come now, tell us a story, and he loses some opinion of us, but every other one likes us. Um, well, who is that faction? I've got faction with one member. Now, it's no one that we're going to influence. Let's just do that. Call to war. Hasten 88. Still kicking. Uh, loadable efforts. Uh, oh, well. So, I get some stress because I'm humble, but again, a load of prestige. Ugh. Well, if I'm doing this in a roleplay way, I think I would have to go with that my wife gets the f uh, gets the, uh, the 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 praise for it who is haston fighting the earldom of leicestershire is fighting against the king of england king athelred okay um so is this actually yeah, it must be haston's war okay he's doing all right he's got King of Danelaw, as well as me. Brilliant. All right, let's go. Let's do this. And I think by the time we come back, we should have enough to claim our leisure's title. And there, and just head straight for the capital. That would be a good place to do. Siege down. Oh, I've died. Okay. And my army's now about to get smushed. So, all our carefully laid plans have now just gone to waste. Um, oh dear. Well, that sucks. That really does. Let's have a look then. Let's get to know our new character. So this is our our daughter now. Um, so she is an alcoholic. 
She's avaricious, so she likes to get lots of wealth. She's a fortune builder, she's vengeful, she's impatient, and she's chaste. Her heir, rather annoyingly, is her daughter and not her son. Although the son is, uh, although he's Herculean, he's also craven. So, but her daughter is uh, her heir, and she is not the best of characters either, which is wonderful. But anyway, onwards and upwards. Um, so, we've not got any secondary spouses, and we need some. So let's start there. Um, so, let's see. Uh, let's see, is there anyone with I can get an alliance from? Don't look like it. Um, let's see, what else? I mean, we're 47, so we're not going to have any more kids, so it do not really matter, I suppose, in who we have now, really. Um, there's no more children coming. What we've got is what we've got. Um, so I think what we do then, since traits are irrelevant, because we're not having any more kids, alliances are just not happening, I think we play the prestige game. Let's have a look. Prestige, who's going to give us the most? Um, fertile, all, doesn't really matter. Let's marry some old men. <laughs> this guy will give us no prestige whatsoever. Um, that's rubbish. We, need, we want someone who's going to give us some prestige, not just give them prestige. Uh, oh, here we go. Prestige gain. Yeah. Well, that's rubbish, isn't it? Um, well, in that case, we might as well go for... How about a... a we do it for... Get us some... Uh, another champion. Bring someone in. So, that would be useful at least. There we go. Have we got a court physician at the minute? I forget. Yes, we do. It's our dad's former wife. Okay. So, let's... I suppose we could have a look and see if we can find another one to bring in, because she's knocking on a bit. Uh, let's see. Physician. Renowned physician. Um... There's only her that's a renowned physician. Let's try physician. Oh, hang on. That's the problem. Not got it on all, got it on top realm. So, uh, let's see. We want it to be someone who is within our diplomatic range. We want adult. We want a male. We want unmarried. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I mean, will you come to the court? No, you won't. Let's try another one. How about you? Can you? In are you interested, sir? No, you're not. How about you? You can't even be interacted with, it would seem. How about you? No. I don't think this is going to work, do you? I don't think it is. Right, so let's... Let's go back to... Let's restore defaults. Let's go back to the idea of bringing in someone... <laughs> I can marry Hasten, <laughs> marry a really old man, 89 year old. Um, let's go back to the idea of bringing in someone for their prowess. Um, probably better off, let's put some things on. We want them to be not a ruler, uh, we want them to be male, unmarried, um, Our religion, ideally. There you go. How about you? Would you be willing to 
Come along. No, no one seems to want to. Tell you what, let's go back to the normal list rather than doing it through that menu. Let's go to that. These are people who are at least willing to marry our lady. Uh, well, you're fairly old, 63. Yeah, but how old are you? 32. Right, there we go. And I think we've got one more, but we'll, we'll deal with that in a minute. Right, so we are now in a bit of a bit more of a pickle in that a lot of our land, or well not too much at least, it's just this bit has dropped away. So I think the first step is to try and get our land back. Um, so the, who is this? This is our nephew and this is our half sister. So I think if we strike quickly, we should be able to get our lands back easy enough. Um, we are going to have to deal with the fact that we're going to get smushed. Our armies are going to get smushed up in England. Um, what should we do for this? Well, she very much likes the idea of getting money. So it'll be, I think, wealth focus for her. Let's sort out the council. Uh, probably you guys. There we go. Excellent. Uh, are there any control issues here? No. It's just on the mainland. So we'll go with that. You can go back to doing these types of things. Do we even have a claim on this? Yes, we do, I think. Claim, claim, yes, we do. Right. So let's try and get our troops out of there as best we can. Things are probably not there. There you go. They're not going to go very well. Let's bring our troops home. Uh, scheme discovered. My scheme to see ri that my rival dead has been discovered. Now everyone knows of my plan to kill Aram. So this must have been cooking before the succession happened. Um, and I don't know who he is. It's our champion. I don't care. Um, all a big misunderstanding. Sure. That works for me. So, right. Let's see if we can get our men home. There we go. Yes, we we're involved in that war. Yes, we turned up. But dad's dead. And now it's our turn to rule. So... Let's set our rally point for our army over here. And what we got here, negotiate alliance. Who's this? Oh, she's not one of our... She's under, under the one that we're trying to get, so... Oh, yeah, fine. We'll sign an alliance. That'll help once we take over the lands. So let's start with him. My claims on all that. I need most prestige. That's rubbish. Let's get it. Have a feast. That'll help. Demand artifact. Nope. No artifacts for you. You can have some money though. Well, I'll get money from them. Uh, we'll ransom you back once you've got enough money. Who's this fella? Our son can get married. Anyone wants an alliance? A good alliance would be useful. Um, so, I could get an alliance within our own realm. That doesn't really give us much in the way of help. Um, she's 60. We're not marrying him to her. 11, 8. My niece. Lots of family members. Um, Tintagel, that's in Cornwall. I think a lot of these are just within our own realm. So, uh, we'll just go with that one. There's inheritable trait there to be gained, so that's good. We'll stick with that. Uh, not endorsed by our shaman. Sway her. Brilliant. 
All right, so I'm actually going to end the episode there for today. This uh, episode uh, went on when I was recording it quite a little bit longer than I anticipated. I kind of got absorbed into what we were doing, into our quest for a kingdom. So it goes on a little bit longer, quite a bit longer actually. And so I've dropped this episode into two halves. And uh, the second half will be in the next episode. Uh, So do please come and join us for that and see how our quest for a kingdom continues. Uh, But for now, please consider liking, subscribing to the channel, commenting on the video, and I will see you in the next one. Take care. Bye-bye.